Okay, so this is Slow Love, and um... I have seen Slug Love, and it is bad. <laughs> that sounds like the end of Return of the Jedi. Slug Love, we got the Slug Love. Oh, oh stop. <laughs> slug Love. Slug Love. Slug Love is awesome. Slug Love. It's also awesome. Slug Love. Celebrate Slug Love. Celebrate Slug Love. Celebrate Slug Love. <laughs> what Sorry. bird? Because like I know that it's too long to hit him. <laughs> <laughs> no, when, when I start any rendition of Love Love, I have to keep going. I'm sorry. Did you call it's it just... Love Love? No, Love Love. It's from the end of Return. It's the Ewok. It's called so... Yub Nub. Oh. Yub Nub? No, I thought it was Lub Nub. No, it's Yub Nub. Do you speak fluent Ewokese or something? Is Who that cares? I saw two slugs making out! <laughs> okay, so let's talk Were about... Were they just making loud? Rob's slugophobic thing going on here. Obviously, you can't take two slugs just because I love for each other. Just because I see it as a sin in the eyes of God does not mean I hate these slugs. <laughs> oh, so but, you know, a goose and a, you know, a fox kissing is perfectly fine. Oh, well, that's natural. <laughs> I really get disturbed by all the anti-slug love, like... Signs in that that church. Yeah, no, I agree like, yeah, that me. Yeah, yeah, it's like I hate them hell. so much. You know what? I'm still gonna enjoy my slug fillet. Okay. There's nothing wrong with eating them. Who cares? Yeah, I mean, they can still love each yeah, other. Yeah, I mean we can married. burn them. You know, and declare we don't want any of them alive. But just don't kiss. Whoa. Right? <laughs> Is that what you're saying? Too far. <laughs> <laughs> too far. Or not far enough. Not too far. This is oh. slow love, <laughs> and uh, it's it's just a story about a slug and a snail, and the slug is gigantic and looking for a girlfriend. So Finn and Jake help him, but turns out he's a slug, and then he finds a slug that thought which she was a snail, but wasn't. She was just attached to a peppermint, <laughs> and then they hook up and they kiss. But it's all a sin in the eyes of God, anyway. So of who course, she leaves to Satan. <laughs> Um, more room in heaven for me. <laughs> uh, honestly, I I thought this one was just okay. Honestly, uh, it, it, the only reason I can say it, I think, is because sort of the title too, just that it is slow. <laughs> it's just I was sort of like, we just get him the damn girlfriend. My favorite yeah. thing was the computer that gets like, yes. yeah, 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 that that thing gets crushed in the Bimo. opening when they throw yeah. it to the side, and then just the slow comes in. Poor Bimo. There was a really good lead up joke with Bimo that I loved. It's like when he when um uh, he's trying to play Bimo that's uh, a live Game Boy for those of us that are just joining. It's not a Game Boy. <laughs> a game it's or, a Bimo. <clears throat> okay, a what Bimo. is a Bimo then? Explain to us what a Bimo is. Bimo is a Bimo. Well done. I had continue. a feeling saw that coming. So um Jake yes, there's says... an actual episode around his history. Oh okay. Or it's history. Oh that'll be fun. Yes. Okay. Well keep going. <laughs> Jake asks for, so kindly asks for the newspaper that he was reading and um, just sits there slowly. You see it coming from a mile away and it just beats <laughs> up with it. I, yeah. I, I just love seeing a dog beat something else with a rolled up newspaper. Yes. Um, I, I think you wanted to do that with your own computer. <laughs> no, 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 with, with my did. fist is what I wanted to do that with. Um, but, uh, am I the only one who thinks that the slug is Slurms McKenzie in his retirement day? It does yeah. the Futurama. I get, I get, slug, he's like, party on. <laughs> yeah. No, that's only you. This is nobody else. No, I saw it. I saw it. How too. can you see it? I saw slugs fucking today. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know what you were watching. <laughs> Read uh, all in your head. Read through the context, man. Read through the lines. It's all a metaphor. Everything in the Slug Bible says metaphor. that this is wrong. Uh, the slibble. The slibble. The I just slime really, bowl. I just really liked how all the shells on the snails had butts. Yeah, and apparently snail boobies is now a thing. Yeah. <laughs> Snoobies. <laughs> I think we're just gonna have to accept animals drawn with boobies. Doug, I, I, I guess so. Not till they can in. draw ones with retractable penises and stuff. Um, wow, well, we have to accept. Actually, slug most sex. animals kind of technically do have a retractable penis. Maybe that's the explanation of the Looney Tunes. Like, maybe they do have junk. It's just all hidden inside. Well, that's well. Honestly, yeah. That's if you look at an animal, what's there is not technically the penis. What comes out of it? That red thing. That Jason's penis. done a lot of animal experimentation in his day. And...
awkward stare? No, I mean, that's a, that's okay. a fact. <laughs> no, I, no, I think, you know, you know, I think, no, 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 I think judgmental stare. No, it's creeping me out, so I'm gonna stop. So. Let's look back to the camera, just away yes. from Jason. Um, what does one say to this? this? <laughs> I mean, like I said, I, I thought it was just okay. What, what, what do you think, Jason? Talk! No. Oh. <laughs> I was just talking about penis. <laughs> I'm what sorry we interrupted talk your about penis. <laughs> talk about the episode without penis, if you can. Well, there were no penises in here. Why is your mind not so penis? So it should be very easy for you to do. Go ahead. Talk uh, about so No, I, I... No pun intended, I do agree. It was a quite slow episode. Um... I was not a huge fan of the snail character anyways, snail slug character anyways. Not likable, not hateable, he was just kind of bleh. Yeah, every time they said like, you know, oh, but we'll help him out, I was sort of like, yeah, I'm not getting that vibe of the, oh, he's so cute, we want to help him. Yeah, thing. but right. I did like when Jake first played the female snail, mm. and then played the male snail, and then he's like, kept switching between the two. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was good, I really liked that. How about you, Brad? I, the... B this being what the fourth episode? No. Yes, yeah, yeah, that you've seen, seen, yeah. yeah. Um, it's it it was okay. Yeah, the the randomness was definitely interesting, but not as much. It was replaced though by metaphors that are quite frankly disturbing. There is sad juice, which I will let people discover for themselves. And then at the very end, when the snails are making out, and, you know, it's like, okay, they're just making out. You know, maybe it's not going to go too far. Bemo, the creature that was being beat up on the entire episode, they get spilled entirely with this I juice that was unseemly. I can't about sad that. juice just be sad juice. <laughs> I, actually, I, I was going to say. The, the creepiest part about it was actually Bemo's watching and making out going, <laughs> yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Go, go, go! I mean, go. That, that was just like so weird. I could look room. at him and be like, not disturbed. Really. <laughs> the Bebo is the Denny from the room. Yeah. <laughs> Can I watch? I was thinking. Um, I love like Bebo, though. I, I, I never Bebo thought about awesome. these sick. The sick context here, but yeah, now I can't stop thinking. So. <laughs> yes, because I cannot be a slug <laughs> Uh What about you, Rob? You know, I'm not going to say watching two slugs making out. <laughs> is more freakish than watching Faces of Death while dropping acid. <laughs> but don't ever do that again, Cartoon Network. No, okay. Don't ever do that again. But you, you found that what? more disturbing than the one snail being grinded on by like a dozen female snails. Oh, that was hot. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> that was... That was as hot as the game as That was the <laughs> act of love. It was grinding away. <laughs> How'd that no, go again? No, it'll be just grinding oh, away. <laughs> but yeah, when they lock lips, that was just like... <laughs> it was nasty. That was happy juice. Some really great yeah. lines, though. You smell like cupcakes and rainbows. <laughs> <laughs> or, don't go in there like you'll get slimed or grinded on. And grind it on, yeah. <laughs> grind it on is my favorite. I like, what was, what, was that like an Amish snail that he comes across the second one that had like the bonnet on it or whatever? I'm like, that's odd. <laughs> they all had like kind of foreign accents, too, yeah. which I thought was funny. <laughs> I did like when Jake blows the one tiny little grain of salt on him and it hits him and it just goes... <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yeah, just okay episode all around. Um, okay, this couch is a bit too packed. Can we get rid of a few people off this couch for next time at least? No. Damn. I think Jason needs a hug. Come on, guys, give him a hug. Ah! Yeah, right. ah! oh, Come on. Yeah, you two, get it. Yes. Get it. Hug me. You know you like it. Hug. Wait a minute. Slug sex. That's animal power. I will have good dreams tonight. <laughs> <laughs>